Yo, what's going on YouTube? Welcome to the channel. Welcome back to the channel, you know, for, for returning visitors. Uh, welcome to my official episode two of the No Money Spent series of 2K22, my team. You know, I'm back. I really just made this, this video because I want to open these bad boys. Y'all see them? Y'all see them? Yeah, 2,700 cards collected along the way. I picked up, Tra you know, this Travis Scott pack, Andre Godala, and these Diamond Contracts and Hall of Fame badges. Should make a good 50 KMT off those uh, all, uh, contract packs. So, as you can see, the last episode I had 5.3. As you can see, I got 4.8 basically. So, what I was doing, <laughs> I don't recommend this for anybody because you're going to lose so much MT. I was buying, and you see, I, I emptied out this whole collection, except for a few, because I want to do the XP challenges or whatever. But I spent, oh my God. So if you spent, they say it costs about 450. I think that's like, if it's like 1K a piece, I was buying these for 2.5. So let's say, yeah, 2.5 MT and up. 2.5K MT and up. So I was I was just getting desperate because I, I was like, if I keep waiting, right, everything's just gonna get cheap. When I when I buy certain like these heat checks, they just gonna get cheaper and cheaper. So that's what I did. I just bought them all. I just kept buying them, kept buying them. I did snipe a couple for like 2k and under, a couple of thousand. But on average, I spent about 2.4, <laughs> like 2.4 on average. So I spent a lot of MT. I lost. Damn, it felt like I lost. Like I was at 5.3. At one point, I actually was making MT through like diamond consumables and stuff, but I lost so much MT. And uh, yeah, I, I, man, I lost like I want to say 500k MT trying to sell everything back. I had all the diamonds, some pink diamonds in here. I still got some pink diamonds I could sell, but I kind of want to like this setting because I got a lot of MT. F it, just go for it, right? So a lot of MT. I still, I can still sell a lot of cars. I probably can go back up to five mil, which I plan on doing the next week or two, just selling everything out my collection, everything. So see how much MT I can accumulate. I, I think I can be at six mil, six mil plus, because I got everything else but these heat checks and now all diamonds and pink diamonds. I bought everything up. So with my auction outcomes, uh, nothing special there, nothing to see there. So. Yeah, that's what I was doing, buying everything. And, and again, I do not recommend this. If you don't have a lot of MT, bro, I'm talking about five, six mil. I don't recommend doing this shit. Well, if you do do it, just 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 say to yourself if you really want to go for this dirt and whiskey. Look, this is how I'm seeing this, right? I had to go for 27, right? You could be like, well, you had two point. I, I, I could have went for Paul Pierce, but then the amount of MT I would have to spend, I would have to start getting pink diamonds. And I was done losing MT, bruh. I was done. I was done. So I said to myself, that Pierce is ass. 500 tokens. Okay. But knowing 2K, they haven't really did anything with the token you know, market. The token rewards are decent and all, but the token market is ass, it's booty cheeks. I don't want it. Yeah, we don't have to talk about it. Dark Matter, Gary Payne. I am missing out on this, but the amount of MT, because I was at 2.4 million MT before selling everything back. Bruh, I was down. I was down bad. Yes, I got the, the you know, the you know the good rewards along the way, but I lost a lot of MT. I lost about 600k MT. I could have easily bought Kevin Durant. I could have bought Clay Thompson. I could have, you know what I mean? So... I told I, I I'm not really because by the time he come out, we might get a Ben Simmons that come out. Let's think about it. We might get a better point guard than Dark Matter Gary Payton. Yes, he'd be the first Dark Matter. He might be the best point guard for a week or two, maybe three weeks. But you know how 2K do things. They're gonna release a better point guard, a ten times better, a, a more a more athletic point guard that can get all these contact dunks with some crazy ass defensive stats. And I ain't going for it. Now, the Diamond Shoe and Boost refill pack. I feel like I'm going to lose a lot. Like, I feel like this is worth it. But the amount of MT, again, I lost 500k MT selling everything back. So, 
I might make my NT back, but then again, I have to keep pushing up the levels. That means I have to keep spending more and more. So all that MT, I'm losing 10% tax on everything I sell. So if I spent two mil, that's 200K easily. If I spent three mil and sell everything back for the same price, that's 300K, four mil, 400K, five mil, 500K. So that, yes, you get that. But let I, I want to talk about this real quick. Let me talk about this real quick. The best level reward card so far has been Gerald Wallace, bro. And it might be Iggy. But Iggy was already in the game. We already knew we was getting Iggy. Right? And then Gerald Wallace for 1,700 cards was is still, to me, the best cards you could have got. Especially around the time. Around the time, this was the best small for it in the game. I, I, best defensive small for it and best small for it. I feel as though in the game. It, Andre Godala is not even the best. He's I don't even think he's top five. You know what I mean? So this card to this day is the best. Why? And then they released Bernard King after Gerald Wallace. Make no sense because Bernard King wasn't that good. Then they released Kevin McHale. Wasn't that good. Alonzo Mourning. Trash. Terrible. Throw that motherfucking mm, I cussed already. Oh well. Throw him in the in the dump in the dumpster. And, and, and close it, seal it with, with some concrete. Do whatever you got to do to seal that muff. You, you feel me? Because he was trash. Iggy, good. But not even the best. He's not in the top five. Small for shooting guards, I don't believe. I don't believe. And that, that's why I decided to go for 2700 because I need those badges and those contracts. I need that. I need that. That's the only reason why I went for 2700 cards. And you could say, well, how about if they release some good mystery players? And it's a big if, because so far, the only two good cards they release is Andre Godala and Jared Wallace. And Jared Wallace has still been the best, especially for his time. They release a Paul Pierce who's ass on both gens. He served a purpose. You still can use him, but he's still ass. He's terrible. Gary Payton gonna be real good. Of course he's gonna be good. He's gonna be good. But for how long? And these mystery players, I'm, I'm not gonna hold on to millions upon millions of MT just banging on the idea that 2K is gonna do do right by the community and give us some banging ass content right here. Cause no matter what, they always gonna release the best cards in the game. And I don't care about this Clyde, bro. By the time we get this Clyde, we probably gonna have some invincible Kawhi already. <laughs> like, bro, fuck. F that card. For real, for real. And that Dirt No Whiskey, unless they change his jump shot, which they probably is, he's not going to be the best center in the game. I guarantee you. I can guarantee you. If they would have had like 3,000 tokens here and like 750,000 MT, this would actually be more worth it. But it's not. It's just not worth it no more. It's not worth it. It's, I, I bet you in 2K20, they have, didn't they have like 3,000 MT? I mean, tokens? I'm pretty sure they gave you a sane amount of tokens. This shit, not really. So that's that's that was my idea. That was my reasoning why I sold everything back. I just want my MT. I got the cards. Now, let me just show you my team real quick. Just you know, this is my best team, Julius Irvin. I sold my uh uh what's that? Joe Johnson because his release wasn't that good to me, and he just ran out of energy too much. He could move better, Julius Irvin, but for what? <laughs> he loses so much. I play him in clutch time. This man got like 60 stamina. Two minutes left in the game. I'm like, yo, F that. And I lost about 40k MT selling him back because he he became cheap. I bought him. I sniped him for 100k. I could have sold him back for like at least 120, but whatever. I lost. And I locked in this Antoine Jameson. 120,000. And I already locked in Demarcus Cousins. And I got, you see the rest. Exchange, Tony Medeiros. He's actually got a fire jump shot. I love his jump shot. I feel like that's one of the best jump shots in the game. It's just that. Just give him with a shoe boost. Let me let's go over his stats real quick. Just for people to uh 73 ball is not good, right? But with Steph Curry you get a 75. And if I put a plus four three pointer, that's 79. Plus a floor general, that's 80 something right there. Bang. You good. And that ball handle, give him a ball handle shoe. Coach, I mean Steph Curry already, you good. Bang. Defense, you want to probably improve his block perimeter defense. Or you really just want to go speed, speed, ball, acceleration, and lateral quickness. For real, for real. It depends how you want to do it. But he's good for now. I'm trying to get the Maurice, uh, Maurice Lucas. That's what I really want. 
But I feel like I'm not going to get it. But okay. So, bang. This is what y'all really here for. So let's open it up. Uh, let's open. This is what you get for, what's this, 2,400 cards? Let's see. Let's just open all. I got a lateral quickness and two, uh, two three-point boosts. Perfect. <laughs> That's perfect. That's perfect. And you can't sell these shoes, which is a shame because you could have made so much MT, but 2K being 2K, you know how that goes. Let's open individually. Let's see what I get. Come on, I need to speak with ball in here. Lateral quickness ain't bad. Stamina, boo. I mean, whatever. Strength, boo. Three-point shot, good. They about to hold me and not get me speed with ball, is they? Okay, shoe. Are y'all sick? Acceleration, not bad. I'll take that. I'll take that. Pass vision, boo. I want to speed with ball, man. Give me a speed with ball. They, damn, them Jones probably cheap. Them, them Jones probably cheap. Damn, how many three point Jones they about to give me a ball? God damn. I mean, I'll take it. I'll take it. That's probably like 5 KMT, 6 KMT. I'll take it. You might have finesse it and get 10 K a piece. Come on, they doing me dirty. Give me a speed with ball, bro. There we go. There we go, finally. God. They, I, I ain't liking this, though. How many cards are left? Look, I don't know. Oh, okay, here go to Jordan. Acceleration. I take that, though. That's about 10K. They give me another three point. We're going to have to throw hands, 2K. I mean, I take it, but Speed Ball is the most expensive one. Y'all gave me one. Oh, y'all about to just give me one, ain't y'all? Yo, I better see. I didn't even see a speed yet. Give me a speed, bro. Man, fuck them shoes. There we go. God damn. Oh, uh, there we go. Okay, okay. Y'all made up for it. Y'all made up for it. Uh, Y'all made up for it. Y'all made up for it. Let's open this. Let's open this one. They they made up for it. I probably made like a hundred k. Make up for the MT I lost. Probably way more than that. I, I can't do math. I'm sorry. And here goes that Iggy. He's my starting shooting guard. He might be my small for it. Yeah, he might replace Gerald Wallace for now. Because he's actually probably better than Gerald Wallace. And I only say he's better than Jared Wallace because I, I I could like you have to look at it like this. Look at it like this. It's a badge. Oh yeah, Hall of Fame. Blinders. But look at it like this, right? I'm talking about the time. For the for his time, Jared Wallace is better than Andre Godala for his time. Because people was able to use him. Yo, comp players would use him during the two fi two fifty K quals. Andre Godala might not even be used. That's what I mean by Gerald Wallace was the best one we got because for his time, bro, you can run him. I still run him to this day. He's that good. Clance. Oh, my God. Let's go. <laughs> Yo, I swear the next card that need all this shit, I'm putting it all on it. I don't give a fuck. Uh -huh. that, that, that's just, oh, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. Damn, I can't screenshot it. I had to screenshot it. No, I can't screenshot it because I'm... Uh, oh, yeah, that was good, right? Oh, that was satisfying. But that's that. I probably could sell that. I'm going to sell all this and make another, you know... you can, uh, I'm going to have all the prices, you know what I mean? How many fuck... How many three points did I get? I got eight of them, Jones. I would have took... Damn, I didn't get a speed... That's corny. That's corny. But yeah, anyways, that's the video. Uh, hopefully, in 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 my third episode, I'm going to have all the all these sold. Hopefully, and you can see how much I made. So I uh, I see y'all guys next time. And if you like this video, like and subscribe. 
And in the future, hopefully, I can add music. I don't know how to do that yet. I'm gonna add music, all that. I'm gonna edit a little bit more, better. And we're gonna take we're gonna take this YouTube shit by storm. We're gonna be on our anime shit. We're gonna be on Fire Force. Oh, check out Fire Force too. Really good. Y'all watch anime? Fire Force. I'm out. <laughs>